Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It is time for us to talk about my May empties. So, I got this big box on the floor. It's not really big, it's my regular box, but it's full to the brim. So I wanna to talk to you about these products and uh, yeah. Not a whole lot of special stuff in here, but there are some good things. So I'm gonna zoom you in for a minute. So the first thing I have is, this is the um, Dove Shower Foam, um, Deep Moisture. I didn't like it as much as I just re like the regular Dove body wash. So I normally only use like the Dove, the, the sensitive one and, and or the Aveeno Baby body wash for sensitive skin because my skin, <laughs> Like stack crazy. The other thing I used up, I always have this outside my shower, is this Dr. Teal's Foaming Bath with pure Epsom salt. It's the Soothe and Sleep. I use this all the time, night and day. Um, the other thing in here is the Boom Boom Cream from, I can't remember, uh, Sol Janeiro. This is what it looks like. Everybody's seen this, right? Everybody recommends this stuff. It's okay. It's... I think this thing was $40. It's not $40 worth. Don't tell Sephora I told you that. Not worth 40 bucks. Uh, the next thing I have is... Um, it's actually... It's, it's not... I didn't use it up. It went bad on me. But it's from my girlfriend's um, acne line. She actually does all natural products, soaps, body washes, shampoos, face things, all kinds of stuff. And this was the lotion for your face. I'm still using that um, wash. But the lotion went bad on me. Because it's all natural, you have to, there's no preservatives or anything in here. So you got to kind of use that stuff up as you buy it. Um, the other faith product I have, I got in, I think my Allure box, this is the CEO from Sunday Riley. This is fabulous. Love it. I gotta buy another bottle of this. I loved it, loved it. Let's see what else I got from my face. Going through my little box. So I had this little um, Estee Lauder Resilience Lift Night. It was a little sample. I've already bought a full size of this. This is really, really good night cream. It's not heavy. It doesn't make you feel like you got cramp all over your face. It's perfect. And then the next thing I tried was this um, Tarte Drink of H2O. I had a little sample of it. I, uh, yeah, no, not a fan. Enzo, sorry, Enzo is moving around. I did have one hair product in here. I had the Label M Diamond Dust Leave-In Cream. This stuff right here. I think Casey Holmes talks about this. It, it's no better than that stuff. Called, I think it's called the Perfect Ten. It's the same principle. I do like the Perfect 10 better though. Okay, now let's talk about some setting sprays. I really went to town on some setting sprays. So I finally used up this um, Project Beauty uh, spray set go. There's a little bit in the bottom, but it doesn't spray good. Like it squirts clumps on your face. I don't like it. Um, the other thing I used up was this Milani Make It Last. I already have another bottle of this. This is very good setting spray. And then I had a sample of the Skin Dew from Pharmacy Skincare Brand. And just, I, I didn't, I didn't like it. I can't help it. I can't tell you guys I liked it when I didn't like it. I just didn't like it. 
Let's talk about some perfume samples I used up. So the first one is the Michael Kors Sexy Ruby. And it's just a little sample like this. I didn't like it. Then this is the Kat Von D Center. It's okay. It's really heavy. I don't really like a heavy perfume. This Tory Burch, Just Like Heaven, is fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. I want to buy a full bottle of that. And then I used up my Velvet Teddy from MAC. I'm not very impressed with the fragrances from MAC. It's odd because I love everything else they do. Okay. The next thing is I used up a bottle of foundation. It's my CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Elixir. Of course, I will be buying this again. And then I had this old concealer in my drawer. It's like the Becca, I forget what it's called now, but it was, it was like, it's like a concealer, but it has shimmer to it. Ew, I don't want that. Trash, plus it's old. I did use up the Kat Von D concealer. I had the little bottle um, and I really did like that, but I had a much lighter color as a backup in them. Glad that I moved on. Um, I had another Their Real um, mascara. I do not like this mascara from Benefit, but that new Bad Girl Bang from Benefit, oh my God, that's fabulous. That is fabulous. It's like my, it, it's given my Marc Jacobs a run for its money. A run for its money. Then I used up a little MAC. Um, False Eyelash Extreme. Um, I do like that mascara from MAC. And then I have two brow products. I did not use one of them up. Because it's falling apart now. But it had already fallen apart. So this was my It Cosmetics Brow Power. Alright guys, sorry about that. My camera overheated again, of course. Screen camera, I don't know what I'm going to do about this thing. So the next thing that I have, I actually forgot this when we were talking skincare, is I was using up this um, Checks and Balances by Origins. It's a frothy face wash. I did like it. I think I have a couple of samples of it. Um, so, you know. It worked. It's face wash. What do you want me to say? Right? I love it when people get on it. Oh, this is da -da -da. you know, blah, blah, blah. it's gonna it's gonna make all your blackheads go away. No, it's not. No, it's not. I promise you it's not. It may clean them out, but it ain't going away. Alright. I'm getting on a rant. Alright, let's talk about this. I was trying to explain to you my brow power from It Cosmetics. It was new, I had opened it. And I went to use it one day, and first of all, this was stuck in the lid. It's the, it's the brow product. I had just started using it. This is all we got left? I'd have been really pissed if it had been really long. This thing? Done. Done. All I hear is click, 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 done, jump. And then I, I still had my brow, my tattoo brow from Kat Von D. She stopped making this, but um, I did always enjoy that. So that is it for my empties this month. And we are going to have much more next month because I'm focusing on finishing shit up to make room for more shit. Thank you so much. I'll see you guys next time. Mwah.